How the hell are ya? It's That Metal Guy 1983 back to you guys with another craft beer review. Thanks for stopping in, spending your time with me. Means a lot to me. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button. That also means a lot to me. We're rolling. We're growing. Let's get after this beer. I've got one from a Washington, basically an establishment in brewing. We're talking about Alasian Brewing Company. We've got their brand, Frick. King new goblin party. Ain't no party like a goblin party because a goblin party don't stop. Woo! All right. Milkshake, pumpkin milkshake IPA. These guys having a grand old time. You saw them in the intro. Yes, an IPA. We're not doing anything out of the ordinary with crazy color pastry beers or fruited sours. We've got an IPA. But hey, it is a milkshake IPA. And the can has this to say. Ain't no party like a goblin party. This pumpkin milkshake IPA boogies down with vanilla, lactose, and a touch of pumpkin spice. Graham cracker crumbs get their kicks in the mash and whirlpool while those pesky goblins lindy hop the night away with Citra and Galaxy. Woo! Cheers, my friends. Hope you're having a great day. Don't forget your Oya Army pillars. Spread that peace, love, and understanding. Embrace equality and acceptance. Let's get in to the nose of this beer. Getting those citrusy from the citra hops. Galaxy giving us that tropic. And you do get a little bit of spiciness in there. Some fair carbonation in there. But uh, definitely not any sediment in there like some of the ones that I've seen with pumpkin type spice in them. But let's see how this tastes. Mm. 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 Winner, winner, Mofokin chicken dinner. We've got a great flavor. Not too heavy on the pumpkin spice, not too heavy on the hops. Perfect marriage of the two, guys. That is a refreshing, unique style IPA. Great job, Elysian. I really like this one. Woo! Washington represent. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is very nice. Well... <clears throat> I really dig this beer. I think it's great. I've been drinking Alasian off and on, trying their different stuff for years. Uh, I think the thing, the first kind of off the beaten path thing that I tried was Super Fuzz, which is like a blood orange ale. But I've tried just about everything else I can get my paws on from those guys. You know what? There is one thing I haven't tried from them, surprisingly enough. I haven't tried Space Dust. I know, weird. Uh, but definitely... If you can find Goblin Party by you, this is a great fall, uh, winter offering. Definitely recommend it. Check, check, check to check it out. And keep on rocking and oh, yeah. 